Okay boys, we're done up here on the mountain and we're leaving the gondola and oh, here we go. Oh. <laughs> it's not like a roller coaster. It's no. Nice and slow. Definitely not like a roller coaster. But it's nice. You don't have to look straight down. No, you don't. And it's snowing now. Yeah, it's really snowing. Nice even ride as well. And that's where we're headed, down the end there. You probably can't see it, it's in the middle of the screen. I'm glad we got photos coming up. It's yeah. Like foggy or snowy. snowy. It doesn't look like we're moving, but we're actually moving pretty quickly. to see anything because of the snow but there's mountains out there and there's the um, what's the one in the middle of the tunnel mountain tunnel pass mountain or something that's we're staying at the foot of that mountain that you see in the center of the screen right now tunnel mountain. yeah and then our little center is right at the center of the screen now just at the base it looks a bit like a white circle And there's the Banff Springs. That's at the center. Very nice ride going down, isn't it? Uh -huh. So it's 623 meters from the base to the top. And I'll time how long it takes. <laughs> In case it's ever a question on Jeopardy. <laughs> <laughs> Four minutes and 23 seconds. What is how long it takes to get down <laughs> Sulphur Mountain on the gondola? Oh, you're right. That place, like I said, is the Park Administration yeah. building. There's a right down there. Yeah. It looks really nice, but it was originally opened as a sanatorium. Oh, no, you're crazy you, with the um, view, though, eh? Some doctor found the healing aspects of the Banff Springs and opened a sanatorium. Well, a sanatorium doesn't mean insane no, asylum. No, no, it's for people coming to wellness get healthy. It's a wellness yeah. center. Kind of like naturopathic healing. Yeah. Well, that's what probably Dr. Kellogg, the guy who created Kellogg's. Yeah. That's what he did. But now the, the Banff Springs are there. You can actually kind of, you can't quite see them. It's across the street from that building. You can see the pool. But you can actually go in the Banff Springs, can you not? Still? Yeah, that's what people are doing. Can you see the pool? Uh, Across from the street from that, you can see a, an enclosed pool? Or maybe it's not even enclosed, I don't know. Oh, I see it. That's just a pool, though. That's not no, the springs, No, that's the springs. That's oh, really? the, um, on the advertisement. Wow. And then that building is the, <laughs> the park administration. Well, that's us looking down right now. That green thing's called a pylon. And those support the gondolas. Has a little weather beacon up top. Tells you how fast the wind's going. And you can come up here at night and they have different lights on. Yep. Like a light show. But you wouldn't be able to see all the mountains as well. No, definitely not. To think we walked all the way around down there last night and we didn't even know we were surrounded by mountains. <laughs> that was funny, wasn't it? Oh, there's mountains. That's nice. They're huge. I don't know if you can see them or not, but I still want to see some there's, on, you can't see the here. top of it because it's all shrouded in snow. We're getting some snow here. It's only about plus one, minus one. It's really close to zero. It's windy though. Yeah, it is a little windy. Close this for, like, oh, I'm sure that I'm sure they do for wind. Yeah, yeah, it's not that windy here for us though. No, 
Oh, there's something. What? Oh, it's a dog. Oh, oh it's a... <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God, it's a mountain lion with a leash. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, oh, good. It's wildlife. It's pretty crazy not wild. Wildlife. It's oh, that's it's a trail. See yeah. that? <laughs> that's something. Oh, it's dog. <laughs> if I hadn't had the leash on, we would be convinced it was a mountain. Oh yeah, it was a cougar. So apparently, also um, they say to look out for elk, and um, what's the other one? Cougars. And um, although the guy has never seen a moose, the taxi driver told us last yeah, night. Yeah, I've got tons of moose stuff here, but he's never seen a moose. <laughs> no, I guess them. you just think of trees and forests and wildlife. You think of moose. Yep. We've, we've probably seen more moose in Algonquin. Mm-hmm. Well, we've seen like what, fifteen, twenty moose in Algonquin? Yeah. So we're coming down to the uh, what do you call it? The, Gondola house, gate house. Yeah. The base camp. Base camp. So far, six minutes, fifteen seconds. Here comes a gondola, right at us. Oh, not quite at us. There's a lot of. I don't think there's a lot of people here today. No, there isn't. It's not very many people going up. I mean, it's only what Thursday, right? So it's not a real like the weekends are going to be pretty packed. These are impressive. These mountains, holy! Yeah. We're right at the base of that mountain right there. That's a small one, just Tunnel Mountain. Where do they actually go to ski and snowboard? Like I've seen they other people. They go up the mountain. See the see the path right there. That's a ski run, and that's a ski run, and then over we've seen all the here. Getting off the bus with snowboards. Yep. Yeah. Because it goes, because the, the buses, the buses go all the way up, around and over and past the other side of the mountain to get to, uh, um, what's the other one called? Torque Mountain or something or Torque, Torque Mountain. So right now we have to catch a bus and go back into town and then get a taxi up to the Mount Center. Because mm -hmm. the buses don't go to the Mount Center, which is kind of crazy. And it's nine bucks every taxi ride. Too bad they didn't have this conference at the Mount Springs because the buses oh, yeah. go there and they that have shuttles nice. and stuff like that. Would be nice. But it would have been very expensive, I'm sure. So here comes base camp, gondola, whatever. There's ravens all around here too, Parky. Big, big, big bear birds. They're, uh, you know how we have our crows? Almost double the size of our crows. Very large. We should, um, if we have time on Saturday, I don't think we have time today, but we should take the bus and stop at the Van Springs. Yeah. Yep. I'd like to see them. Or even tonight. I don't know. How much more cars are now? It's called the Lower Terminal. And elevation is 5,194 feet above sea level. <clears throat> We're about 1,200 um, feet above sea level at home at, in Coburg, and this is uh, 5194. So there's some more people. There's where I got my picture taken. And we're coming in for a landing. Yeah. It's all automated, so don't worry. Ooh. And that's it. Nine minutes, 10 seconds. <laughs>